Hey everyone, Garrett here with Vox Direct. Um, hey, I, uh, I wanted to talk to you guys real quick about uh, a case study that I put together. And I do want to preface that um, this case study was not uh, one of my clients. I found this, uh, this information elsewhere and I just created the graphic. Um, however, it does still illustrate the point that text message marketing is extremely powerful as a tool. And it is something that should definitely be considered in every single business because as time goes on, um, technology is advancing and, and, you know, business owners, at least in my experience, from what I found, uh, the fewer modes of communication that you have with your customers, the more likely you are to die, or at least your business to die. You know what I meant. But from my experience, what I've noticed is that businesses that have more communication with their customers or more modes of communication, rather, they tend to thrive. They tend to, tend to do better because they have more ways of reaching the people that want to give them money. And at, that, that holds true everywhere, uh, including your business. So um, it doesn't always look the same and there are different ways to use it, but you know, there are different circumstances for everyone. I wanted to talk today about how Silverstone Racing Circuit made a marketing campaign that generates 680% ROI. Pretty good if you ask me. Um, there are there are some really really crazy numbers out there. Um, this is still really really good. Um, so Silverstone broadcasted their offer to uh, over forty five thousand recipients on their database who had expressed an interest in attending future car events and or had previously purchased a F one ticket. Um, those things satisfy the criteria of. Um, having a having permission to send a message um, because they have an established business relationship um, or they've been given direct permission to um, give marketing messages to those customers. Now, what I want to talk about now is what actually happened. What was the message they sent that, that yielded 680% ROI? Um, and, and, and that message you can see up here in the top right. Uh, I'll, move, I'll move me so you can see it a little bit better. Um, I'll move me over to the other side. Um, did you enjoy the, the Monaco Grand Prix? Get your tickets to the British Grand Prix at Silverstone now. Link here to opt out, text stop to this number, right? So they, they broadcasted that message to 45,000 people. They had people opt out, but they also were able to stimulate engagement with the customers that had expressed interest in seeing that. And so people would click on the link and they'd buy their ticket. Um, and they just, it's just getting in front of your customers and saying, Hey, you know, you told me you wanted this. Now do you want it? Cool. Here you go. Right. So the broadcast went out immediately after the finish of the BBC's highlights coverage of the race. Um, why is that important? Because it's timing. Timing is super important in a lot of circumstances, especially with promotions. Um, that text went out right after the highlights were covered. So Maybe an hour, maybe two hours, who knows? I'm not really familiar with the Grand Prix, to be honest. But I can't imagine it would take more than two hours, really. Um, anyway, it's, prob it's probably the same day, or while it's still fresh on those watchers' mind, right? So maybe you're still trying to get to your car. I know how that goes at sporting events. I'm sure the Grand Prix is no exception. Um, so maybe while you're still walking to the car, maybe while you're still in the parking lot, trying to get out of the parking lot, maybe while you're on the way home, maybe as soon as you get home, you get that message and says, Hey, did you enjoy that experience? That race you just watched? Did you like it? Well, if you did, here's a ticket to another one. That's going to be even better. Do you want it? Cool. Here's a link. Um, so with a, uh, with a simple click, fans were taken to a mobile site that was optimized for mobile devices. And then they ordered it. Um, Right then and there, it's pretty easy. It was just like, hey, do you want this? Yeah, okay, cool, here, sign up. There you go, put your information in. There you go, cool. Um, super easy, super fast, super efficient. So what happened? What were the results? What did, what did Silverstone get for that? Well, that one text message generated a return on investment of 680% for Silverstone. What does that mean? It means for every dollar that they spent on this broadcast, for every dollar that they spent to send those text messages, they made $68. That's pretty good. That's really good. Like, if, uh, if, I gave you, if I gave you $68 for every dollar that you gave me, how many dollars would you give me? Probably a lot. 
Um, and you know, that's, that's kind of what we do is we want to optimize that as much as we can. Um, so perhaps text message marketing could be used in your business. I think it can be used in every single business. There's different ways it's used, obviously, um, cause every situation is different, but you know, I think that this is something you, if you want your business to grow and if you want your business to thrive and more importantly, survive, especially in, in the context of our current times, um, in the middle of August, 2020, we're still uh, neck deep in uh, virus. So it, it, if you want to, to have better communication, more direct communication, communication that your clients actually want, maybe take a look at Vox Direct. You can get my information by uh, texting the word Garrett to 844-267-6492. That'll give you my contact info. You can uh, connect with me on LinkedIn. You can schedule a call can get my email, get my phone number, harass me a little bit if you want. But um, I, I would also encourage you not to just look at Vox Direct. We're not the only text message marketing provider. Um, there are, there are some, some providers that do different things than we do. Some places that do things we don't do. And you know, maybe that's more your style. Maybe that's a feature you're really, really hung up on that you really, really want. Um, but there are some things that we do really, really well. And uh, I think text message marketing is one of them, especially because because I'm here and uh, I'm a nerd on text message marketing. Um, so if you want to to have a quick call about strategy, how you could use it, I'm happy to do that. Um, no expectations on that call. Just I, I enjoy talking about text message marketing, to be honest. Um, but yeah, I, I hope that this uh, this was informative for you. I hope uh, you see a little bit more about the power of text message marketing, how it might be able to help your business. Um, yeah. I hope you enjoyed it. So ha have a good day and uh, I'll see you next time. If you made it to the end of the video, go ahead and uh, type pomegranate and uh, prove that you uh, watched the end. I'll see you soon. Bye.